I am laughing to myself as I come on this video. A couple things. One thing, I'm wearing my hot chocolate, my Hello Fall fuzzy socks because I'm ready for it to cool down. How about you? The other thing I'm laughing about is my chair was almost to the floor and I kept thinking, why does it feel so low? <laughs> well, it was down to the floor, so I fixed that. That's just me. Uh, Cindy A. Lewis here, as you already saw, and we're going to do some bead pins today. I have uh, some that I want to make for gifts that I need for a trip I'm going on. And I can't wait to see my coworkers, but I wanted to make them a bead pin. Also, I did want to let you know that this is Craft Your Stash Month. And so I'm using my stash. Now, some of these things I purchased not that long ago, but they're in my stash. So if you um, get some bead pins, you can save this video, come back to it and watch it if you don't have them already. And I hope, you'll, I hope you will, because it's so simple and easy and such a very, very cute gift. So let's jump in. Bead pins are really easy to work with and you twist them open to write with them. They do write really nicely and you just need some beads that will fit over the wire, which is a, a pretty, you know, relatively common size. So these are some pins that I made um, not that long ago. This one is the snowman with some snowman beads from um, a kit that I had. And then these are some foam beads that came in another kit with this little cute gingerbread house and a little cute stocking. So speaking of that, this is going to be a hidden giveaway prize in today's video. And to enter, you would put in the comments bead pen and this will be the prize that will be going to someone that has um, wins the hidden giveaway. Now the hidden giveaway will be uh, drawn um, when we draw all the winners for the Craft Your Stash uh, challenge this month, which is on August 31st. So if you want to, check out the Craft Your Stash and don't forget to enter to win this bead pen. I'm gonna set that aside for now, and I'm gonna show you how easy it is to make these. So really and truly, you need a bead pen. This is one set, I did get these from Timu. This is another set, and these are mostly all red, like for Christmas. And that's really it, except for your beads. And you can use any beads that you already have, so I have some set here. You can also order some. So here is the little mugs that I showed you one time. That would be really cute on there. Um, I've got these snowman beads that are from a kit from Timu, actually. These are the uh, foam beads with some accents, super cute. These are also really cute, Christmassy with the paws for your puppy kitty. And then some fall beads that I have on hand. I think those are from Timu as well. And then I had some really fun other beads. I have these crosses that say Jesus and these mugs um, for the coffee lover. So anyway, we're going to make several and you'll see how fast it really goes. So let's just do a blue. All right. So first to do your bead pen, you're going to take a pen and you just unscrew the little topper. Then you do need to make sure that you, the hole in your bead is wide enough to fit over the um, the spindle because some of these beads are not the hole that they've drilled is not very wide and you might have to actually you know drill another hole if you want to. All right, so we're just going to build a little little bead pyramid, I guess. And that looks like that goes all the way to the top. So you can play with it, see how your beads sit on here and see what you like. And then you just screw that down. So let's do another one. Let's pick pink. This is really pretty. And we'll just use some pink beads. Let's see what we got here. I have some that are still on the string. So let's put this one first. And we'll put a pink. And I 
let's get another one of these real pretty ones they're faceted or something they're so pretty and you just this is what you do so i'm just gonna chit chat with you a little bit to make these bead pens and then we'll be done for my gifts so i'm going to show you uh let me show you how i'm wrapping them have you ever seen the um pretzel papers or bags so i'm just going to slide the pin in there and then we're going to uh, i'm going to twist some ribbon around it so we'll just use this ribbon here i'm going to grab this one and then i'm just going to wrap it around it a couple times and then tie a cute bow and then it will be ready and i'll probably cut that extra off there because we don't need it and there we go and just cut that i'm just going to cut this there we go and there you have a nice little gift and it's so cute and cost effective all right so if you'd like to hang out with me while i make some pins we can i'll chat with you and these turn out so pretty and again i actually did test the ink and it writes really nice so and then some of the purchase uh some of the different um, bags that you can purchase these bead pins in are like 20 per bag and so anyway all right well if you're hanging around and everything i'd like to know if you've ever made bead pens before they're pretty fun um and i am loving them so i'd love to know if you've made uh, bead pens so this one is purple and i'm going to use some pearl and some purple and uh, beads with this so i have I have this one here and then i have dark and then I'll put a pearl bead. And then another dark one. And then a square one. And then a pearl. Actually, I could put a coffee on there. Let's do that. Let's see how that looks. So we have these different, I have these different ones. That might be cute on there. Let's see what they look like. <clears throat> Aren't these cute? That looks like Chick-fil-A. These are super cute. I'm going to try this one. I know it's not purple, but let's see if that would fit. Let's see. Let's take that one off. This one's really long. Um... I wonder if I should do like purple, 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 and then put it on and see if it fits. Here we go. That's cute. Very cute. Let's do another purple one and do it with the pearls. All right, here's another purple. And we could put um, like this one on there or this one. Oh, it says nurse fuel. They're not nurses. Okay. 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 So let's do this. Oh, that's so cute. All right. Let's do. Those are cute, don't you think? All right, let's see. What can we do? These are nurse, so I don't have any nurses. Iced coffee, that would be cute on this one. Let's change it, don't you think? Or the latte one, or, or what's iced coffee? Oh, that's super cute. Look at that, is that cute? These are super cute, oh my goodness. Okay, so let's do a black and white. Um, let's see, I have some beads here. And we could do, uh, 
a mug with, uh, let's see, let me get these out. All right, let's switch it. Let's do the little check, the solid, a little clear, and then we'll put the coffee mug. And then we'll screw that on. That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Aren't these just super cute? Oh. We could do orange. We could. Let's take um, a little, let's go green. Now these are the foam. Let's go white, green, and then let's slide this one on there. But it's too tall. These are really tall, these little things. Look how cute. They just turn out too cute. I'm just so excited about them. Uh, now I'm just making a way over here, and some of them are um, just for gifts and then I'm sure that I will give some more away. But I'm trying to decide whether to do any Christmas at all um, because I don't know if I really need to. It's a little early. I need, which one? The iced coffee is cute. Um, this one's cute. Might have to take that off. Slide that iced coffee on there. All right. I've got a red one over here. Let's see what color. Let's do another pink. And we'll put, we'll put this one on there. So let's do, let's do pink and a pearl and a pink and then we'll put this see if it'll fit these are tall these little foam coffee mugs look how cute Okay, and we'll do a blue. And I've got that there, so I can grab a blue and the faceted. And then this one, and then another blue and a pearl. Now this one, I'm not gonna put one of the coffee things on it. Here we go. So anyway, thanks so much for joining me. I could keep going and going because this is super fun to do. And it's really easy too. But um, thanks so much for joining me. I'd love to know if you uh, ever make these and if you have, what colors did you make? Thanks so much and have a great day. And don't forget to enter the hidden giveaway to win the stocking pen, bead pen. Just enter the word, words, bead pen. All right, I did finish uh, the pens that I'm gonna take and uh, they are super cute. And I just wanted to show you that we'll all be wrapped up and um, ready to go. Thanks so much for watching again. I wanted to show this at the end, so don't forget to enter um, the hidden giveaway.